sports fans, and welcome to the craziest, wildest, bloodiest extravaganza outside of Juarez, Genki Bowl 7. I'm Zach, and you all know my tag team partner, Bobby. Bobby, previous Genki Bowls have had no lack of surprises. Of the nastiest sort, Zach, and this year will be no different. Murder, mayhem, and fun are all just a big part of any Genki Bowl, and the genius man cat has cooked up an exciting list of never-before-seen events that promise to be even deadlier than anything we've ever seen before. Oh, hey, worse than the Grizzly Bear Rodeo from Genki Bowl 4? There is absolutely no doubt about it. <laughs> wow, I'm actually salivating. Oh my goodness. And as an added bonus, Bobby, we've just learned that the leader of the Third Street Saints will be taking part in today's festivities. Think they can keep the winning streak going, huh? We're about to find out. The games are gonna begin, so let's get down there. And when I say down, we mean down. To the action! Here we are, Genki fans, at Apocalypse Genki! Today's match was created by Angry Tiger, putting her own spin on the classic super ethical reality climax. That's right, Bobby, and I hear there's new things in store for our mascots. I think Tammy can fill us in on that. Tammy? Thanks, Bobby. In the deepest, darkest corners of the jungle lives a great warrior, protected by fierce traps and mascots. Bodyguards, she. Whoa, 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 hold on there, Tammy. What are you doing? Um, reading the script Angry Tiger handed me. She handed you a script? And the best part's coming up. <clears throat> she keeps her minions in line through the threat of shark infested waters. So beware, ah. all who enter the jungle of the Angry Tiger. <laughs> well, that was entertaining. Thanks, Tammy. Oh, you're welcome, Zach. Amazing. Sharks are a new addition to the Genki wheelhouse. Looks like those mascots better hope they don't fall in. is absolutely on fire. Oh, I thought they missed that one. Oh. Ethical. It seems like a lot for this player. This is quickly becoming a performance for the record books. This is really amazing shooting. Great execution Cash by this thing. Pocket. Oh. How's things behind the scenes, Tammy? I just spoke with one of the mascot trainers, and he expressed his apprehension at the new format created by Angry Tiger. These mascots have been coming to Genki Bowl for years. What has them so worked up with this match? With so many of those hired to fill the ranks of the Genki mascot army, taken from the streets of Steelport, they're more used to the urban jungle than the actual one. Now they find themselves on unfamiliar ground. It's just a set dressing. And How bad can it really be? Reports of malaria, yellow fever, and gangrene have been pouring in over the last few days, putting several of the mascots in the hospital for treatment. I call shenanigans on this set. With a contestant as deadly with a firearm as the leader of the Saints in Genki Bowl this year, they're just looking for a way to get out before facing their impending death. Oh, I have to agree, Bobby. You know, it looks like fear is getting the better of them. <laughs> Several mascots have already lost limbs due to the gangrene, Zach. Better than catching a bullet with their face. <laughs> well, the hunter is loose. <laughs> this is Extended unbelievable! Reality! Quite a Extended performance so far. Reality! like a lot for this player. Oh, a mistake like that would make anyone frustrated. And that is the match! Welcome back, Genki fans. It's time to watch as the leader of the Saints tears up the town once again for fun and profit. Fun and 
Right, Zack. This giant ball of death yard seems to be the perfect way to cruise around the city of Steelport. But only in sexy conditions can you find such a mode of transportation. Outside of Yankee Bowl 7, what's your favorite way to get around, Bobby? Well, that's easy. By helicopter. You aren't afraid of heights, I take it. If I have to choose between getting mutilated by the drivers in this city or a carefree flight with a view, I think the choice is obvious. But what if there's some sort of a uh, malfunction that causes the chopper to go down? Parachutes are a wonderful invention, Zach. And I have no idea what you've done. I saw you putting sugar in my gas tank last night. Okay, this course already, and just as expected, this saint can soar with the best of them. No doubt, but eager to please the fans, Professor Genki has ordered the difficulty ramped up this second time around. Speaking of eager to please, let's check in down on the streets with our girl, Tammy, what you got? I'm standing on a rooftop downtown with executives from several steel court banks. Champagne is being served by scantily clad women, while long events are being placed on how this saint will perform today. What's the spread for today's match? Only those buying in are giving the numbers, but this wager may explain the seven jumpers that were scraped off the street after the last match, Zach. <laughs> Ouch! So that's why my bank closed down. Yes! The red page is about to begin! I'm beginning to feel bad for sad pandas. Why is that? Well, well, how would you like your face to be synonymous with unethical? Well, the unethical targets are the ones usually avoided by you. So you're saying it's better to be ignored? No wonder she's so depressed. Get ready for the rooftop, Bobby! <laughs> Genki Bowl 5. 
You know, the only real airtime in that was the two seconds of free fall between fending off attacks from monkeys with machetes and falling through the carpet of buzz saws. Here, you don't have that same risk. Good point, Bobby. You know, unless, of course, the parachute doesn't work. Or a plane flies into them. Right you are. Or let's say wild panda hunters on the ground start shooting. <laughs> Wait a minute, okay. Now you're stretching it. Getting those ring there's the end of the match again, Bobby. Genki is sure to be happy with how well Sad Panda's course has been a crowd pleaser. And our contestant is sure to be happy with that result. Thanks for watching Genki Bowl 7, everybody. See you next time. Bye now. Oh, would you believe it? Did you see that? My goodness, a performance for the ages. I don't think I've ever witnessed something so remarkable. Incredible. That was, without a doubt, the most amazing individual performance I've ever seen since Ping Pong Polly worked Thursday nights at Safe World. Oh, I remember that. Hey, Bobby, how about we go down to the lovely Tammy Tolliver, who is standing by with our new champion, Tammy. Thanks, Zach. You know, over the years, you've had your doubters. Some have said you were just riding on the coattails of more accomplished people. Is this vindication for you? Uh, absolutely. Uh, not just for me, but for all the kids out there watching at home thinking that they'll never make something out of themselves. Uh, yeah, I just want to tell those kids, no matter what, work hard and anything is possible. Oh, what a great message to end on. Well, Zach, I... Hey, you know, I, I spent years honing my craft. Murdering, robbing, assaulting, more murdering. Light treason? Murdering again? All so that when I got my shot, I would be ready. Uh, that's, uh, enlightening. But what- You gotta follow your dreams, kids. Cause if you don't, you know what happens? You're gonna become your parents. How fucking depressing would that be? Think about it.